welcome back to Animal Wonders. I'm Jesse, and this is Kimosabi, the porcupine. Hi, buddy. He's snacking on some of his breakfast. Yeah, buddy. Today, we are going to do a fun unboxing, and I have my box right here. It's from Avery. Let's get in there and see what's going on. Thank you so much, Avery, for sending this to us. It's very, very generous. We got a nice cozy blanket. Look at it. Oh, there goes a blanket. It's taped on there. Oh, let's take a look at this. Oh, look, she tied all the little ends. Avery, good job. Good job with this. This is so cozy. And let's see what else is in here. Fun little toys here. Look, just, oh my gosh. Look at this little bed. She glued these together into a cute little frame and then she put a blanket on the top there. Oh my gosh, that is just adorable. I love this. Well done, Avery. Oh, this is for Chili Pepper. It's a little, look, it says Chili Pepper on it. It says a, it's a little chew toy for him. Oh, that is great. And this is exciting. I'm not sure what this is. It looks like, like a little party inside a box. Look at this. Oh, it is just packed with goodies. Got a TP roll. We have oh, a little, <laughs> a little and there's so many goodies to play around with. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take out all of these really fun things and I'm going to give them to different animals and then give this box to another animal and maybe keep a couple of toys in here. So much of, what do you think, Kimosabi? Do you want some of this? He's just, he's just hanging out in the back there. <gasps> Mealworms, mmm, delicious snacks. <gasps> do we have a little note? Look at that. That's a little cute picture of a bird. Animal Wonders, I love your channel. Please open and give on camera, my neighbors. Avery, Avery, thank you so much. I love how creative you were with all of this, especially this amazing little box. Look at these TP rolls. You guys know that we definitely use TP rolls. <gasps> and another chew toy. Wow, the gifts just keep coming. I am so excited to give the, oh, <laughs> I'm so excited to give the gifts to the animals. Let's go and do that now. All right, first up is Tickles, the hedgehog who lives right in here. Let's see where she is. I think she's hiding under here. Oh, here she is, there she is. Hey, cutie. Okay, so what I picked out for her was this fun little toy, this adorable little bed, and matching blankets because she loves to cozy up in a blanket. Um, and this little bed is just going to be super cute underneath there. And then these mealworms, dehydrated mealworms. She loves her treats. So go, let's go ahead and give them to her. All right, Tickles. Do you want to come on out and see what we have for you? Hello, sweet girl. I know I woke you up. It is evening though. You've already come out and eaten some of your food. So you should be ready to come on out and check things out and explore. Look what we have for you. There you are. You say hi. Put some mealworms in the cute little bed there. Is that the good stuff? <laughs> she obviously loves those little treats. All right, we're gonna put this cute little blanket in here so she can move it around and get it all cozy in there however she'd like and you know i'm gonna put this right on there so she has to push it out of there if she wants to eat any more food there you go what do you think about that she loves it look at her licking it yeah hedgehogs like to lick things that they don't really know what they are and uh they will sometimes lick it so much that they'll create like a little froth on it, like spit, and then uh, they will put it on their bag. She's trying to bite it. That's super cute. 
All right, that was really fun. I bet she's gonna play with this a lot more, especially to get to the rest of her food. So I'm also gonna take this little bed and put it under here as well, because I think, I don't think she can do that on her own. So I'm gonna put it under there. Um, she's not really, she doesn't chew like rodents, so this um, hot glue is safe for her to have in her enclosure because she's not going to eat it and make herself sick. Um, but chewers like a guinea pig or a hamster, they would possibly get sick and you wouldn't want to give them that glue. All right, we've made that nice and cozy and Tickles has shoved herself into her other little cozy bed over here. So we're going to say goodbye to her. And next up is the sugar gliders who live in here and all the way up to the ceiling. So they are sleeping right now, but it's time for them to wake up. So they live, they're in this little pouch. I see a little tail moving around. And for them, I chose the little fun house. It's got some balls in it that I, these fun little balls, one with the little bell in there and a, a stick so they can chew on it and um, some other little TP rolls in here as well. And they will also be getting some of the mealworms as well. All right, little friends. We've got some fun toys for you. you Wanna come see? This is Boomerang. <laughs> Boomerang is always ready for a snack. What do you think, Ping Pong? Did you find a mealworm? Oh, we did. Yay! He got it! <laughs> All right, so we're back with Kimosabi. He's actually up there right now, but I'm hoping he'll come down. I just had this great idea. Um, I took some of these little um, hanging things and I hid some banana in them. So you can see that I, I hid the banana inside them. Um, and this one I have to make a, oops. I've made a little bit of modifications because if I hang it like this, there's a chance that he could get his leg stuck in it. So I am going to just tie it a couple times and that will make it safe for him, to, for me to be able to leave it in here without supervision. So he can just play and play and play with it. Okay, there we go, he can't really get stuck in there now. So let's go to hang these and see if he wants to come and try and get the little banana pieces from them. All right, let's see if he goes after those. All right, here he comes. Hi, bud. Wonder if he's gonna use his nose to smell the bananas. Yay, he found it. Good job, buddy. That is all yours. Avery, again, thank you so much for your donation. These are wonderful creative gifts and they enjoy it so much. He's just like blissed out right now. Kimo Savi, you have the most adorable little tongue. All right, I'm going to let Kimosabi enjoy his little banana ball there, and I'm sure he's going to find the banana in that back braid as well. Let's go hang out with another animal. All right, we're going to real quick pop in with the cavies, chili pepper and cayenne. Hi, cuties. This had your name on it, chili pepper, so I stuffed it full of uh, hay. It's getting all over me now. And we have a little chew toy here, so we're going to put the chew toy for them to to chew on right there, and this is little thing right there. What do you think, Toast? Is that good? Chili Pepper's coming back for more. Oh, this is wonderful. That's a happy cabbie right there. All right, on to our next one. All right, so we got this little one that says Cheerio on it, and it is getting to be nighttime, but we're gonna go see in here and see if Cheerio would like another little treat. Let's see where 
there she is. Oh, I see her down there. We have Chex here too. Maybe Chex would like it. It's pretty dark in here right now. Oh, there it goes. It fell. Down, down, down. Are you going to go get it? Hi, cutie. Cheerio's just hanging out down there. All right, I'm going to let the chinchillas play and we're gonna visit one more animal. All right, we're here with our last animal today. Hi, Ringo. How's it going, buddy? Are you excited? I picked these out because they are soft and really fun for him to feel with his hands and I hid some treats and put some delicious smells on them. Let's go give it to him. Hi, buddy. Are you excited? All right. Well, we've got lots of good stuff to give you. Let me come on in. Scooch back. Here we go. All right. First up is this little stuffed animal for you. You want him? All the good stuff. You can see Ringo gets lots of stuff. There's a little fluff right next to him where you can see that he already ripped apart another stuffy. He's ripping apart the stuffy because I actually hid food in there. <laughs> you get that, buddy. All right, well, he's going after that. We're gonna go ahead and hang this one up. And for this one, I'm gonna put that right on there. I put some banana smushed in sections of this, so he'll have to find those. He's still going after the, the little bear. Good work, buddy. Yeah, nice work. All right, buddy, he's excited. He saw me, I just hung this up there, and he's very excited about it. But. Get that first. Do you hear him snorting? Does that smell good? Now this rope is very fine, so I will, once he's done playing with this, I'm going to take this out of his enclosure. He can't have this unsupervised just because there are so many little strings on it that he could get his fingers caught in and we don't want them to get wrapped around his fingers but it's really fun for him to forage for them just like this. This is so fun. I, lo I love seeing them having so much fun. This is great. Now what? Is there anything else? There is, I have this one too. This one has little treats in it too. I'm gonna hang this one on this little hook here. And he's back up here. Good job, buddy. This one's fun because the other ones get stuck up there and he can't pull it all the way down. <laughs> Look at those teeth. Oh, that was a good rip. Look at those little nails. He's holding it open with his little nail. Trying to piece it apart. There's more. Yeah, there's another one up there too. Did you see these? These are new too. <laughs> oh, he's having so much fun. This is so great. Good job, Ringo. Yeah, you get it. Thank you so much, Avery, for all of the amazing gifts that you gave the animals today. I loved how creative you got with them, and it was just such a good variety that a lot of the animals really enjoyed it. Ringo is still back there going after some of those toys. If you'd like to send any gifts to the animals, you can send them to P.O. Box 7833, Missoula, Montana 59807. And if you'd like to continue going on animal adventures with us, be sure to subscribe and I'll see you soon. Bye.